everybody, Son of Beast here. Welcome back to another Mamba Moment of the Kobe Bryant Challenge. This next challenge is I'm about to be doing number four, and this is what it goes for. It's the regular season here of 62 in 3 on December 20th, 2005. Here's what the story is by behind it. Kobe scores an, an audacious 62 points in just three quarters. At the end of the third, he had 62 points to the Mavericks 61, outscoring their entire team in a career-defining performance. He has been going crazy all over the court, and he has been a dominant run. And you know that guy? That's Dirk Nowitzki right over here on the other side that Kobe has faced against, and he made a successful attempt to do the 10 free throws at the free throw line for the th first three quarters. I mean, this is going to be a lot more challenging to say if I can get this one right away. But 62 points in the first first three quarters before the fourth quarter? I think that might be a, okay with me, so I'm going to give it a challenge with that. And win the game is definitely the easier way to do this. In the meantime, enough jabbering around, let's get to the challenge and enjoy this one. Let's do it. And please don't forget to like the video and subscribe to my channel. We'll have more Kobe Bryant challenge in the next coming missions on their way. Now enjoy the mission. suffered last time out to the Rockets, only scored 74 points in that game to the Lakers, and that just won't get it done. Kobe himself was quoted after the game saying he wished he had taken more shots in the contest, so I think it's a given. He's going to shoot more than 13 times tonight. Just four to shoot. Dallas needs to get off a shot. Griffin. How Dallas hasn't taken the same amount of threes this year as they did in the past. Johnson doesn't want them looking for as many threes. You can see how different their approach has been. And this is the final game of the Lakers three-game homestand. Clark, they go on the road for the next three. Well, it's been a big homestand for the Lakers. They've seemingly hit their stride during this stretch. And he's got his first chance at the line here. Marquise Daniels at the line for one. defense has been huge for them. Well, the last three games, they've held their opponents to 36% from the floor. You make it that hard to shoot, you'll win most games. Oh, I like the fact that Smush Parker can play either guard position. Obviously there, we saw his passing ability. Terry looking over the floor. The pass to Daniels. Outside Griffin. Dampier inside. He's covered by Brown. Dampier, he dishes to Nowitzki. Daniel from outside. Rebound the Lakers. Here's Bryant. And the dunk by Bryant. What a move by Bryant pulling out his tricks to confuse the defense. About a minute and a half through the first quarter. 
Walker against Terry. Pass to Daniel. Here's Levitsky. Over Cook. Here's Dampier. That shot gets him. Good D by Parker. He'll normally convert on that finish. The defense got lucky. And Clark with the Lakers. When Kobe starts getting hot, you worry the other guys don't get involved as much. I agree, Kevin, because it's easy to watch a guy like Kobe carry the load. I mean, they depend on him an awful lot for his level of production. But if they're going to win, they're going to need other players to get involved. Well, that's an easy, effortless make right at the rim. Yeah, you know this. You, you usually get only looks like this in the layup line. The defense has to make it hard on him right there. Here's Dallas. They trail by one. Here's Griffin. A rebound by Cook. And it's Cook with the ball for the Lakers. Here's Bryant. Again, the Lakers. Good brain stroke of Bryant. You got to admire that. I mean, he's got a terrific feel from here. Kobe's gone four for five from the floor tonight. Just one miss. Here's Daniels. That's out of bounds. The Mavericks able to retain possession here. A wide open look here for Terry. Lakers lead by three. And now let's go to our sideline reporter, David Aldridge. D.A., what do you got? Well, guys, the Lakers had their hands full on Sunday trying to slow down Tracy McGrady. We have an equally tough matchup here with Dirk Nowitzki. The size and shooting that Dirk provides is impossible to match up against. A true test for this Lakers defense. Guys? Thank you, D.A. Dirk has been unstoppable, Clark, to start the season. He can do so much facing up. He shoots over you or puts it on the floor, Kevin. He's a problem and a nightmare to defend. And Dallas calls their first time out of the game. Well, we don't have to guess what they're going to be talking about. We know what the deal is. Yeah, the offense has been throttled. They have to figure this thing out. Short second. Be right back. Game resumes, get back to action. On defense, the Lakers. Griffin looking around. Dallas again missing. Lakers leading by six. Outside, Kobe. Down gets the cup. Outside, Bryant. Another shot. And the bucket is good. Three point play chance here for him. That's exactly why Kobe is unstoppable. Even the aggressive defense cannot hold him back. And the Lakers sit at 13 11 on the season so far, but they've been playing much better of late. I agree, Mike. I mean, they've won seven of their last nine. That includes their win over Dallas, which we mentioned earlier. And this run has moved them back over 500. But the thing I love the most about Kobe is Will. Bryant plays with a fire that is unmatched. You add that to his talent, you have an incredible basketball player. Shot by Terry, no good. The Lakers in the lead. Bryant on the wing. Kellett at 16 for the quarter. Well, they had a plan coming into this one, and they have executed on it perfectly. Yeah, getting out ahead early on by stifling the competition on both ends of the floor. Griffin pass to Terry. Shoots over Brown, and it's good from the elbow. Terry. Love watching Terry capitalize from the big range. Such an assertive shooter from there. Outside, Kobe. Off target from three point range. Defense got all kinds of fortunate right there. Usually he takes full advantage of that situation. I'm sure he'll take another shot at it if they keep giving him openings. Trying to grab hold of that momentum right here. That play, that play right there, that'll fire up your teammates. Hey, they're still competing. You know, I think we're all very curious to see how Adrian Green
Griffin does against Kobe Bryant. I mean, he was only signed to this Mavs roster in the past month, Mike. And if I'm Phil Jackson, I'm feeding Kobe early. Let him test Griffin and force the Mavericks to make an adjustment. Terry gets to Daniels. That's good, and it's his fourth basket of the game. He's a strong four for six. Great feed from Terry. I like seeing him scan the floor and find open teammates. It goes! He's got 20 points this quarter. Brian able to elevate and levitate once he takes flight. Just enjoy the show, folks. Mavericks trail by nine. Pass to two. They get it again. Great positioning on the putback. Good awareness that time to put the shot right back up before the defense can react. Cook, the pass to Kobe. Back to Cook. Here's Kobe. It's down. He's got 22 this quarter. But right now, Kobe's turning that grease on the stove up, folks. He is on fire. Keep getting to the ball, please. And the Mavericks all time here. And as both teams pause action here for a minute, these players are focused on staying hydrated with Gatorade, which is crucial to helping them play the entire game. No question about it, partner. We all know how important it is to keep your energy up. And Gatorade certainly helps big time in that regard. Some changes to the light. Alton comes in for Brian. And George is subbed in for Cook. Now is also making some changes. Jobs check in for Eric Dampier. Van Horn comes in for Novitsky. And Devin Harris is subbed in for Griffin. Here's Harris. Count it. And what a matchup this should be. Lakers won the last meeting between the two teams the Monday before last. That was a back and forth slugfest. Now here's Brian. He's got 22. Points on the quarter. This just proves how tough Kobe is brushing off the defense inside. A no brainer. Terry against Walton. Elbow shot is on the way. Rebounded by the Lakers. And Clark in their last meeting, the Lakers won that contest by three. And remember, Kevin, it featured a fadeaway three for Kobe Bryant late in the game. Drama for real. That score gave the Lakers the lead, and they never looked back. Here's Harris following the basket by Kobe Bryant. And he gets the bucket. Harris has got his second bucket of the game to go. And once more this half, they find a way to get great position inside. Terry against Bryant to the middle. Here's Walton. Terrific assist. A nice finish. Solid play all around. Boy, they didn't waste any time, did they? They got going right away. They obviously had a plan coming in, and they put it to good use. Now here is Ennis over Walton, and that one goes long. Defense pulled out all stops there. They managed to contain a skilled inside scorer. Back to Parker. It's a nice passing here by Los Angeles. Here's Kobe. Got it. 28 points this half. Early on, they built this lead on the power of paint points. Being aggressive in the paint can take a team out of the game early. Terry on the wing, Daniels, from deep. A three-pointer is right on target. Daniels has got 12 in the game. You know, that's how you do it, guys. I mean, he passed his way out of the double team and into an easy basket. George finds Parker. One second left. Got it! 30 points for the quarter. And as we conclude the first quarter, a one-sided game so far. Lakers lead by 12. And we'll get the second quarter underway on the other side of the screen. Thank everyone to Los Angeles and Staples Center. Second quarter just getting going. So it's Parker with it. He'll bring it up for the Lakers. And, Mike, this is the long trip to Staples Center for the Mavs this season. Yeah, they seem to only see each other three times this season. This is the only chance for Laker fans to see Dirk in person. Now here is Harris, following the miss by Kobe Bryant. Harris, right side. The putback. Now look, they bat on the glass, but couldn't knock it down. Lakers leading by 12. 
Bryant down low. Harris is there. Bryant can't get it to go. Harris looking it over. Backed away. Outside for Kobe. And again, the Lakers, no good. I don't think you can ask for a better look, just not the result they were looking for. Yeah, he's got to put that miss behind him and continue to fire away when he gets that kind of a look. Harris has gone 3 of 5, shooting from the floor. And the foul called on Kobe Bryant. That's his first foul. Sacrificing his body, putting it on the line right there. That takes he's tremendous grit. Taking charges, not for the faint of heart. Sasha Vujicic has checked in for the Lakers. Benga, he's checked in for the Mavericks. Novitski comes in for Jason Terry. Now here is Harris. He's got six. Let's it go from 14. Tried to bank it in, but he misses. Mark, what a hot start to the year for the Mavs. It's been Dallas 18 and 6. And somehow, Kevin, that's only the third best record in the NBA right now. The Mavs showing it. They're locked in and taking care of business this year. Now here is Harris. Inside, here's Penga. He gets it to fall. That makes it just a single-digit lead. Boy, that was a pretty assist by Harris. Lakers leading by eight. Here's Bryant. Got it. 32 points now in the half. I like what the defense is thinking right there, but, you know, Kobe's agility allows him to avoid the contact. Harris outside. Kicks it out to Nowitzki. All sorts of time. That shot, no good. Boy, defense non-existent there. But they catch a break as he whiffs it. Pass to Walt. There's the pass to Vujicic. Shot clock at five. A baseline chain. In drop. He's got 34 for the half. And just like that, the last few games, Mike, the Lakers defense has been swarming. They've flipped the switch since the slot of December. They want this to be their identity. Here's Van Horn. It's rebounded by Bryant. Defense was right up in his face there, and it spoiled his attempt to lay it in. That's the Walton. Here's Vujicic, guarded by Harris. Vujicic dishes the Walton. And he's fouled pretty hard on that shot, but he's got the chance to pick up the points at the line. Even against really good defense, Walton able to draw the foul and get himself to the line. This is his first chance at the line tonight. First free throw is good. So accepting of what the team needs him to do. Walton, the definition of a team player. Los Angeles making a switch here. Cooks checked in. And then for Dallas, Griffin comes in for Van Horn. And Armstrong subbed in for Devin Harris. And that's good as he hits both of his shots. Here in the second quarter, just under three and a half minutes played, and in the matchup between two elite scorers, Mike, Kobe has a major lead. He's come out on a mission. Kobe is refusing to have two pedestrian games in a row. And the Mavericks call time here. You know, I can imagine the coach has given them an earful about what's happening in the paint. They've got to clean that up. Yeah, their interior defense has been too easy to crack. Time to get physical down low. Just under three and a half minutes played here in the second quarter. Passes it to Daniels. Shoots from the elbow. That one's in there. The Lakers lead has come down now to just 12 points with the basket from Nowitzki. And what a start, Mike. It's been for Avery Johnson in his coaching career. Took over the Mavs last season. 
as them humping this year. Sports a 34 and 8 record as their coach. Not a bad start to your career. Yeah, Wong puts his team first out there. If he sees a guy with a prime shot, he'll get him the ball. You know, there are cases where the contact doesn't affect the shot. That sure did. Easy call for the refs. First trip to the free throw line for him in this one. Shooting for Dallas, Darrell Armstrong. Taking two shots. The first free throw is good. Armstrong possesses real good leadership qualities. He's a terrific floor general and he doesn't take any plays off. This guy gives you everything he has. And both free throws good for Armstrong. The defense keeps fouling him, and he's making them pay for it. Enzo Bryant will bring it up for the Los Angeles Lakers. Cook kicks to Walton. Bryant down low. It's good. Let's see. 38 points on the half. Well, that's just a demonstration of terrific ball skills from Cook. Avoided the defender and gets it to fall inside. To the inside, Nowitzki. Great D that time from Walton. Los Angeles leading by 14. Oh, Kobe is on fire tonight. His career high within reach. Remember, Brian had 56 points in just three quarters against the Grizzlies back in 02. Nowitzki left side. Griffin against Bryant. Nowitzki kicks to Armstrong. And he's going up for the alley -oop. Walton with the steal. And it's Bryant in the corner. And a miss there on the triple. Mavericks trail by 16. Walls not loose. up empty from 19 feet out. I'm sure he's upset right now. He had a space, had it all lined up, but just couldn't convert on the mid-range jumper. Here's Armstrong, missed inside. Showing great intensity around the rim there. It's part of why he's such a respected defender. And what you love about his work defensively, the ability to challenge and change shots without fouling. In the corner, it's Griffin. Kobe against Armstrong. Two minutes remaining in the first half. Two minutes. Back to Griffin. Six on the shot clock. Last break, the Lakers. Here's Bryant. Oh, 42 points now. How about Vujicic with the handoff? Giving it up to a more open guy. Mavericks trail by 18. Now Armstrong, Nowitzki gets a wide open look. It's good from about 19 feet. Nowitzki's got his second basket of the night. This is why he's a focal point of their offense, because they trust in his ability to shoulder the hook when needed. Terrific focus to get to the basket there. Surprised they left him that much of a lane to work with. That's the Nowitzki. And the jam by Turk Nowitzki. He's not a high flyer by any means, but Nowitzki still can throw it down on you. It's George on the wing. He's covered by Daniels. Kobe passes to Walton. Back to Kobe. Just five to shoot. And Kobe is now tying his season high here against New Jersey. You're not going to get stops against him unless you give an effort. Priority and goal number one has to be tightening up the defense. They can't afford to give him open looks. Lakers leading by 18. Driving in. Kobe is a new season high. He is one bucket away from 50. 27 seconds left in the first half of basketball. Armstrong gets the bucket. Armstrong's got four points now in the quarter. Really textbook use of the dribble. Getting inside to get his work done. And 
Two shots coming up on the line as he gets fouled on the shot. There's no backing down when it comes to Kobe. He'll take on anybody on the perimeter or in the paint. The Lakers have gone three for three at the line tonight. Kobe Bryant. You might finish what finish it off with 50 points for the first half, so that could be the finish for uh, for this one before he gets back on the court to start for the third quarter. Just to let you know, guys. And that's two trips to the free throw line. Cold free throws good for Bryant. Zero reason to time out Dallas. Kobe into the 50s and so much game time left. I tell you, these fans loving every minute of it. Just to close that one off, I'm just going to like go with the freelance. Nothing to use. Average. And get back from here. We've got 13 seconds left to play in the first half. And Horn, no good. And it's the Lakers on the break. Two seconds left. It's down. He's got 22 this quarter. A big man who could do it all. Oh, his versatility shining through on passes like that. And so it's Los Angeles cruising into the quarter break with a 22-point lead. The scoring has been tremendous, and they are shooting lights out with very high accuracy. And don't go away. We'll be right back. The second half is starting up here in L.A. Lakers against the Mavs on this Tuesday night on 2K. Mark, they've had a tough schedule to start the season. A lot of games against tough opponents should get a lot easier for them in the second half of the season. If they can tread water, they should be fine. Terry against Kobe. Fires from 14. Here's Dan Peter. And contact on the shot, so he'll be shooting for the throws here. The way Dan Peter can play outside the paint really Difficult to defend. Now, shooting their fourth and fifth shots at the foul line of the game. Eric and Pierre at the line for two. He's off on the first. Every team wants to have an Eric Dampier. 6'11, long arms. He can anchor you defensively as a rim protector and offensively. Damn, can score from the post when you get it to him. second. And so it's the Lakers with it. Parker dishes to Bryant. Shoots over Griffin. Oh! Kobe again! Close to his career high! And you know, their lead just continues to grow, and it's not just because of their offense. They're getting it down to both ends. Yeah, their defense has been stellar as well. Great work on both ends. Let's take a moment here to check in with our sideline reporter, the terrific David Aldridge. Well, it's been tough for the Mavericks to get wins here in L.A. Dallas has a record of 9 and 45 against the Lakers here in Los Angeles. Now, they've fared better in recent years, but historically, it's been one of their toughest road trips. Guys? David, sensational report. Thank you so much. And Clark, tough for teams to come in here and play. You're absolutely right, Kevin. It's been hard for anybody to get wins here in L.A. And so Nowitzki, that was both of them. And, you know, the offensive skill set of Nowitzki is unique. He's a seven-footer who shoots it like a guard from the perimeter. And he's basically got an unblockable turnaround jump shot as well. Yep, he's their leading scorer in this game and has been the dominant figure today, no doubt about it. 
Now here's Terry. The pass to Nowitzki. It's hauled in by Los Angeles. Bryant looking over the floor. Um, kicks it to Odin. Griffin against Parker. He feeds it to Bryant. And it goes out of bounds. That was off Parker. I'm not sure whose fault that was, guys, but they need to get on the same page here. Put the ball back on here in the second half. Well, Phil Jackson has delivered everything Laker fans could have hoped for in his tenure, Clark. No doubt about that. You're right on. Multiple titles and some incredible team. The second one, he's got a tougher challenge now, but still Laker fans must love the team. You got Brian with 58. 58 points! Setting a new career high! Defense fails to contain Brian. He just leaps up for the dunk. Just over a minute and a half have passed here in the third quarter. Terry kicks to Griffin. Back to Terry. The three. Connects from three-point range. Terry. Terry's got five now. A shooter of his caliber can never be left that wide open. Parker outside. Back to Kobe. Baseline try. Book it! He's got 16. Sweet jumper by Bryant. This shot is just so pure. And the Mavericks call time here. And with their offense sputtering, time to talk things over. Yeah, they've got to get organized and make more of their opportunities. So he's got last two left to do in uh, three quarters. So he's got two more points to go. That means one or take the lead. There might be one way that he might be able to do this if he gets it done right. But don't let him get away with this, because that is going to be a hard one. And yes, don't forget to um, send it off, share it with your friends, and share it to anybody who is here on, uh, on YouTube. You can definitely uh, share it to it any time you like. Hashtag 2K Wildman and a 2K Kobe Bryant challenge. It might be tough though, but hey, listen. That's what I definitely do most of the time. I know, sorry about the uh, little bit of a distraction going on in between, but um, but this is the only room I've got, and upstairs too, so can I go away with that if you got an own studio? So but it's turning out okay, so um, don't worry about distractions, just get back right into this right there. Back to you, Kevin. Let's see if Kobe Bryant can take 62. Terry outside. To the paint. Here's Nowitzki and the layup falls. Nowitzki's got four points this quarter. This was not too far away, Mike, and the Lakers, one of the teams playing that night. It should be fun. Only two. And what a show we've seen from Kobe. 62 points, and it's not even the fourth quarter. Pass to Griffin. Got a piece of it. Back to Terry. Shot clock at six. And it's good for two. Terry's got seven points in the game. What nice touch from Terry. This guy is crafty as a scorer. Back to Odom. And there it is for him. He's got excellent vision on the floor. Creating for his guy with a spot on lead pass. And here's Griffin, still scoreless. A putback, it's hauled in by Brock. Kobe with it, picked up by Nowitzki. Here's Kobe, and Kobe well into the 60-point range now. I can't ever recall seeing anything quite like this. I mean, Kobe scoring at will. Over 60 points with a bunch of time left. He might go for a C-note here. Well, it's been the Kobe Show once again, Mike. He's responsible for over half the L.A. Laker points. And I'm sure that's not how they drew it up. But when you've got a hot hand like Kobe, you have to lead it on a nice vision from the big man, Brown. This really helps overall team chemistry. And so it's Terry bringing it up for Dallas. 
down low. Here's Griffin, and he drops in the way up off the glass. Griffin's had his first basket of the night. It could be a simple game. Work it down low, watch the points go up on the scoreboard. Inside, and the rebound goes to the Mavericks. Dan has got his fifth rebound in this one. Terry against Kobe. Griffin passes to Nowitzki. And the shot goes down. 12 points for him. How do you want? Nowitzki can give it to you inside, outside, in between, off the dribble. I think that covers it all, doesn't it? Passes it to Bryant. It's a nice passing here by Los Angeles. Parker kicks to Bryant. Come on, he's got 17 in this quarter. Hey, it's as plain as my okay. Keep it simple. They want to see how big this lead can get. No such thing as running up the score at this level. It's the mark, and it's blocked by Brown. With Brown's reach now, it's tough to get a shot off around him. Here's Daniels, and there's the drive. Great job finishing that play off. Yeah, very secure. Wasn't it Clark using both hands? Mm -hmm. Nothing fancy. Textbook. Turkey's had an impact, but Mike Kobe has run away in their scoring battle. Kobe is playing possessed. He's made it his personal mission to carry this Lakers offense. On the wing, Kobe. Non-stop scoring machine here. Odom's shot, good. Odom is at his best inside, able to play through contact and still finish. Terry, the pass to Griffin. And here is Nowitzki. Shot's good. Griffin making the play. Griffin's got three assists tonight. Well, he needs help. Scoring-wise, his teammates need to do something. Brian finds Brown. Here's Parker, again Los Angeles. There's the jumper from mid-range. Love seeing that from Smush Parker, making his presence felt. Terry with it. He's got seven to the inside. Nowitzki, number 12, goes in. He's made seven of 12 now. You have to like any chance that close to the move. That's the cup. Back to Odom from 12 feet out. And he can't bank that one in. So it's the Mavericks now. Here's Griffin with the drive. And then Griffin with the dunk. I like whenever Griffin seeks out his offense, especially on the drive. Bryant on the wing. Good! He's got 71 points! It makes sense why they keep running the offense through him, proving how efficient he is. To the middle, here's Griffin, and then Griffin with the jump. How about the leaping ability of Griffin? Going up where the defense can't get his way. Parker, right side. Odom on the way. To the paint. Here's Cook. That one go. It's coming. Cook's got his first bucket of the night. Nothing like setting someone up. Feels better than making a shot. To me, at least. And Griffin scores. The assist by Daniels. Daniels has got three assists in the game. Six second difference between shot and game clock. Back to Kobe. Parker outside. Outside, Kobe. From 18 feet away. Got it for his 21st point this quarter. How about the ferocity from him right there? This guy is relentless. Los Angeles now. That's his first personal foul. Third team foul. Substitution on the court. It's Terry outside. And the last shot before the buzzer is off. And so it's Kobe Bryant making things happen for the Los Angeles Lakers. 
they kept going to him again and again, and he delivered with a monster quarter. And we've got more on 2K Sports coming your way after this break. Failure for free throws, time for the fourth quarter. And that will be it. Five seconds left in the fourth quarter. There's the buzzer, and this one is in the books. The Lakers win on the back of a sensational scoring display from the great Kobe Bryant. I've never seen anything like that. Kobe was locked in, and it seemed like he couldn't miss. Mikey couldn't, and a tough loss for the Mavs. But Clark, they can only shake their head at what Kobe did right before him tonight. Look, Kevin, sometimes when you win, this greatness, you just have to sit back, appreciate it, respect it, and enjoy it. This was a game that we'll all remember for a very long time. And we've got David Aldridge standing by on our sideline with the player of the game. David, it's all yours. Thank you, Kevin. Here with the Lakers, Kobe Bryant. Kobe, a quality win, but how do you carry this momentum onto the road? Continue to focus. You know, approach every game as if it's a playoff game. We have to really prepare very well and jump out on the road and see what we can do. Thanks very much, Kobe. Appreciate it. Back to you, Kevin. All right, David, thank you. For our terrific reporter, David Aldridge, along with Clark Kellogg and Mike Fratello, I'm Kevin Harlan saying thank you for tuning in tonight. We'll see you next time. Mission 4 all done for today, and unfortunately, only two stars will remain here. Only three free throws were attempts for Kobe Bryant to hit it off. And no other fouls was being called, so that got him clean looking. And that being said, that's going to do here for this video. If you like this one, please don't forget to leave your comments down here below. And if you have any recommendations that you want me to do, I'll be happy to be appreciated. Plus, the Michael Jordan Challenge will be here very soon, so I will keep an eye on that. Stay tuned, the next mission will head to 2007 for Scoring Machine. That will be on mission number 5, and there's only 3 more to go. Correct me if I'm wrong. But in that case, this is what the Scoring Machine happens on March 16, 2007. So with that being said, thank you all for watching, and peace out everyone for a while, as the Mamba Moment of Kobe Bryant Challenge Style. This is Sonic Beast, and you can find me on my media on Instagram, X, and TikTok. Link to the About page. And I'll see you all again for the next mission. See you next time. If you don't, if you don't, somebody will.